Lightweight title. Welcome to the fight of the week. I'm Don Dunphy, a ringside commentator. One of boxing's all-time great attractions, Sugar Ray Robinson, continues on the comeback trail as he takes on classy Denny Moyer in a return 10-round middleweight bout of Madison Square Garden tonight. In October, Robinson won a close one from Moyer. The 41-year-old Robinson sincerely believes that he can win back one of the middleweight titles. The style of Sugar Ray, whose 22-year-old 22 22-year-old 22 career began at about the time Moyer was born, has an incomparable record. Answering the bell 160 times, Robinson has been victorious 147 times, scoring 95 knockouts, losing nine, fighting three draws, and one no decision. He won the welterweight crown, which he relinquished undefeated and took the middleweight title five times. In an attempt to wrest the light heavyweight crown from Joey Maxim in 1952, Robinson was leading on points when he collapsed from the heat, the only time he has been stopped. The 22-year-old Moyer from Portland, Oregon, is confident that he can end Robinson's career tonight. Their first contest was very close, ending in a disputed decision. Moyer has won 30 of his 36 bouts, scoring eight knockouts. He has never been stopped. Moyer is 5 feet 8, while Robinson is 5'11". At the commission weigh-in today, Moyer weighed 159, while Robinson was 159 and a quarter. In just a minute, we'll bring you the 10-round middleweight fight between Ray Robinson and Dennis Moyer. At ringside here tonight and among the garden regulars, there's a deep feeling of grief because of the passing away of Ray Addy, lovely wife of Johnny Addy, our ring announcer. All of us send our sincere condolences to John. And now here's John Condon. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Madison Square Garden. Before starting the main event, we'd like you to meet the former welterweight and middleweight champion of the world, Barney Ross. Barney Ross. And here is the former featherweight champion of the world, Willie Pett. Willie? There's Barney, Barney Ross, hero of Guadalcanal. Next foul. Here's Willie Pett, Willie one Pett. of the great featherweights of all time. The next bout is the feature bout of the evening, 10 rounds, is being conducted under the supervision of the New York State Athletic Commission. The judges are Tony Rossi and Leo Birnbaum. Knockdown timekeeper, referee Joe Lascalzo. The timekeeper is George Bannon. The referee for the main event, Arthur Mercanti. This is the main event of the evening, 10 rounds from Portland, Oregon, wearing black trunks, 159 pounds, Denny Moyer. wearing white trunks, 159 and one quarter pounds, the former welterweight and middleweight champion of the world, Sugar Ray Robinson. Robinson. Watch your face. Good evening, Ray and Denny. There is no question that you both know and understand the rules of the New York State Athletic Commission. Let's briefly review some of the more important rules. In the event of a knockdown, you must take an eight count. Three knockdowns in one round will automatically end the contest. Separate on the command break. Shake hands now, come out boxing. Scoring here in New York Another on a round basis with a supplementary point system in case the rounds come out even on an official's card. Denny Moyer, 22 years old, wearing black trunks. Sugar Ray Robinson, 41 years old, in the white trunks. Referee Arthur McCanty, the bell. is half a pound lighter than the last time he fought. Moyer is two pounds heavier. Robinson keeps 
cocking that right hand. Moyer has never been on the candle. Baby face a little bit stronger than he looks. A little trickle of blood from Moyer's nose. Tribute to Robinson's jab, no doubt. One minute to go in round one. Boys roughing each other up on the inside. No doubt having no respect for royalty. Moyer is bleeding rather profusely from the nose now. That could have an effect if he swallows too much blood during the contest. seconds to go in round one. There's the bell. Coming up to round two of Madison Square Garden, Dennis Moyer, the black trunks, Sugar Ray Robinson, the white trunks. First round, fairly even. Scheduled for ten rounds. Both have been scoring with uh, sharp jabs. Moyer a little more aggressive than he was in the early rounds last time. left in this round. They've been countering about equally well. Moyer got over a good right hand, which reminds me that most of the good punches up until now have been left hands, jabs or hooks. it has on Moyer. Sometimes the action is delayed. is bothering Moyer.
too nearly over. There's the bell ending round two. Crowd likes it. Here we are in Robinson's corner. A familiar trio in there with him. There's Harry Wiley, his veteran trainer in front of him. His personal doctor, Dr. John L.S. Holloman on the left-hand side and the Emperor George Gainford, who has been Robinson's uh, mainstay.